Hello, hello, Bodan here. Welcome back to my playthrough of Final Doom TNT Evolution. Today's level map 28. Heck, let's begin. Alright, and straight at the start we have some revenants on top of the pillars. So I like to kill them with rockets. Just two rockets for each of them will be enough. See, he is ready for me. Anyway, now they are gone. And we have some imps coming out of this alcove. So that should be my first section to go, the one to the right. Alright, I think that's all for the imps. Now we will need to take care of this revenants over there. If we can. Alright, finally they are dead and we can grab some items over here and uh, go to the next section, which is this one. But be careful, there will be an arch oil coming up for you, so you should be quick. And those were two chain gunners that spawned at the same time as that archway, which is really nasty trap. I don't like it. All right. So here comes another tricky section. I like to alert the enemies first, then drop down, take the yellow key which will spawn in even more enemies and then just kill all of them at once. Just be careful not to stand in the same position for long. You can kill the rest of the enemies either with super shotgun or with uh, rocket launcher but Probably rocket launcher isn't a very good idea here because there are a lot of lost souls. So I'm not sure. At least we can get them in fighting a little bit. Let's wait until they are done. Right, and that's all of them. Luckily, we have a precious mega sphere over here. After this fight, very much needed. Anyway, we now have the yellow key and can proceed to another section here. Except I lost a little bit of my plasma here. So I should be using some other weapon instead. Maybe super shotgun will do, because we still have some spare ammo over there. And it's good that this area isn't... I mean... This floor isn't damaging. Now you better. Let's go grab the remainder of the ammo over here. 
and now we can continue to the next section. This map is really interesting, I should say. So the next section would be the opposite to the this one, which is that one. And be careful because there are some enemies over there. Enter this uh, section with the gargoyle sign, and each time you see a gargoyle that is not inside an alcohol, that basically means that there's a fake wall and an enemy inside, or an item like that one, for example. See, there's a backpack inside. And I think I alerted the Revenant here. He nearly got me. There's another wall with the gargoyle on it, which means there's an enemy inside. Also, don't forget to flip that switch, which will reveal an arch one. Looks, looks like BFG didn't kill me. And he managed to resurrect some enemies already, which is okay, because we can grind ammo from them. Let me see the map. I think I covered this, right? So the next way to go is here. Because this new area appeared. What? Ah, I forgot about this wall. It was an enemy inside. Okay. Oh, there you are. That was unexpected. Come on. Revenant. Okay. And as you can see, there's another wall. Only this time it contains a box of cells, not an enemy, thankfully. Oh, one more area revealed with one more archway. And he zapped me, unfortunately. I wasn't quite prepared for that because I I forgot, to be honest, that he will be here. But that's okay. We got everything that we needed from this area. And now we can move on to the next one. So with the blue and the yellow key we can go either to the blue or to the yellow door. I think that's the yellow one. I will save the mega armor for now. But because there will be another arch one. Luckily the archvile cannot resurrect lost souls 
because they don't have corpses. My goodness. He's so relentless. I just want to kill the lost soul, come on. Give me a second here. And he's dead. Now we can grab all the lost, I mean, all the <laughs> box of bullets. And prepare for the next fight, which will contain some revenants over there so I like to fire a couple of rockets straight away and then hide from their rockets right we could grab the mega sphere straight away but we will be returning here later so for now I will just grab uh, this mega armor since we can do that and proceed to the next area. Sorry, I was a little slow here. Alright, so what do we have here? Let me see. Some more rockets. And eventually we will come to this area with a lot, a big cluster of enemies. I like to fire two BFG shots and then drop down. Or maybe not even drop down. But we can spend some time up here before we drop down. Because there are a lot of demons after all. And lost souls. I really like this area and this map overall because it, it basically allows us to make to make a very strategic. How did you survive a rocket? I don't know. quite a strategic fight because you have those pillars and you can play around them so let's go here now and grab the red key which will reveal a bunch of revenants so I will shoot a couple of rockets straight away and then proceed with dancing around these pillars since we have a lot of them here anyway all oh, right I really like this room and this area overall this is very nice although it's completely red but I'm okay with that Grab anything you need here. And we can move on. So, I said that I will we will grab this uh, mega sphere. So, I will do that right now. Preferably without any legs. I don't know why they happen to me. Probably that's just a GZ Doom thing. All right, so the last room is behind the red, blue and yellow door. And it contains a cluster of nasty enemies. Like this low sauce. So I like to shoot just one BFG shot and kill the rest of them with the super shotgun, right? Although I'm not sure if there's any super shotgun ammo left, but I'm okay with that. 
So now we can exit this level. That was map 28. Heck. I really like this level. <clears throat> I should say. It, it will be probably one of my favorites. Because it has such a really cool... Um, areas for tactics and combats, right? And some cool encounters, ex except for a couple of arch vials that spawn in, in the areas where you don't expect them. So you have to be ready. For some reason during this uh, playthrough, uh, none of the arch vial died from the BFG blast. I don't know why. Sometimes they don't die from BFG. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next level. We are approaching the end of the game here and that would be River Sticks. Bye bye everyone.